Do you need to confirm that your diners have been fully vaccinated? Res Diaries custom field tools can request this information at the point of booking. Find out how to create a custom field, add it to your widget, view this information in the grid view and running order, and include this information within your booking report. First, make sure you are using the most up-to-date version of the Res Diary widget. It should have the Res Diary logo at the top and widget V2 loader in the embed code. If this is not the case, contact our team via support at resdiary.com.au. From your diary, click Settings, and in the Reservation section, click Custom Fields. Here, you are able to create a new custom field. First, fill in the Name section. This will be the question that is posed to your diners. Make sure it clearly communicates what information you require to comply with regulations. Under Field Type, make sure text is selected and check the boxes Highlight and Required Field. Make sure the status disk is green, this signifying that the custom field is active. Once happy, click Save. To make sure that your custom field appears on your widget, from your diary, click Settings, and from the Diary Configuration section, click Online Settings. Here, open the Interface Settings tab, and under Res Diary Widget and Portal Settings, select your custom field from the drop-down list. You can then save. Now, when the diner fills out their contact details, they will be required to provide some information regarding their group's vaccination status before completing the booking. Bookings will now show an information icon and the customer's response will be shown in the Spider menu. When making internal bookings, the Details tab will be highlighted. You will not be able to complete the booking until you have included a response to the custom field. You can also create a custom booking code that will show on the booking bar to quickly inform your team which diners are vaccinated. To do this from your diary, click Settings and from the reservation section, click Booking Codes. Here, click Add, name your new symbol and enter a single character and click Save. You will now be able to select the option from your booking codes. This information can be included within your running order. From your diary, click Reports, and from the Settings section, click Report Settings. From the list, you should see the name you gave your custom field. Tick the box for it to appear in the running order. You can drag and drop the entry to reorder the columns shown in the running order. Make sure to save your changes. You can also add this information to your booking details report. From the diary, click Reports, and from the Booking Reports section, click Booking Report. Open the Booking Details tab, and under the List Settings, click Edit the columns you see in their order. Click the Columns drop-down, and the name you gave your custom field will appear in the list. Click to add it to the report. If you have any questions, you can find more information about custom fields on the knowledge base or can raise a ticket by clicking the help icon or emailing support at resdiary.com.au.